Alright, hey guys, welcome to a new video series I'll be doing. And essentially what I'm going to be doing is uh, playing online games uh, online and commentating on them, which I've been wanting to do for some time. I just never had the equipment to do it, but uh, now I actually do. So I am very excited and I can't wait to uh, film this series. Uh, the first game we'll be taking a look at is uh, Day of Defeat Source, which is a classic game. But what I've noticed over the, uh, the amount that I've been playing it is that people have indeed got a lot better at the game. Uh, but that's, so that's why I'm trying to get a little bit better at the game and try to just, I guess, yeah, get better. Um, I'm super excited about this, though. And I'll be doing full playthroughs of games like Doom and uh, probably Oblivion and Skyrim. So it'll be fun. But without further ado, let's get into some of these online matchups. Alright, so first we have a uh, DoD Avalanche server going on here. It's a 24-7 server that I play on all the time. Uh, I highly recommend favoriting this server. Uh, here we got one guy behind me. Oh, now I pumped out like 30 bullets into this guy. His blood is all over the wall, and I just decide, you know what, I'm going to shovel him, and that's just what I do. <laughs> so, with one guy down, we are one and one. No captures yet. Uh, essentially, if you don't know about this game, the whole point is to capture every point uh, against your enemy and uh, kill as many people doing it as you possibly can. Here we have this one machine gunner who's just running down, and, I do, and I'm able to capture their last point, which is very effective for our team. Uh, going up to the sniper position, uh, I put some strategy into this one right here. This guy's clearly following me, so I go into this one room, surprise attack him like that. Uh, this is a, one of the best maps. I highly recommend if you don't play this map, definitely do it. Uh, it's got a nice mixture of capture points and uh, side, a little bit of, uh, let's see, probably side routes that you can take to flank people. Now, I actually planted a grenade at the end right there, and I did indeed kill that guy who killed me, so that was pretty funny. We got my Richard Nixon spray. Uh, I just come up with the craziest phrase, and that just happened to be one that uh, I'd use for this video, and I thought it was pretty funny. Now what I usually do for this map is I usually go to the left of that time. Or wait, I actually do. So I usually go to the left here, and it flanks around to the end, and that's how I usually take the last point. I try to just flank them as I can, as in taking their last point first, and then moving up from there and holding the last point as much as I possibly can. But, um, here's what I was talking about. This is where I flank. Pretty nice sniping position up there. I think I do get a guy. Yeah, I got him. By the way, my Steam account is Rebel Pilot. Um, I don't know why it's Rebel Pilot. It's just always been that, and I've never switched it. Quick check to see if anybody's behind me. Nobody's there. Alright, jump down here. I killed one of these guys, but I did not get the other. Uh, and I didn't end up capturing the point. There's this one window uh, above where I just fell out, and uh, I usually take that one, but I just didn't that time. I don't know why. Moving along now, I'm going to take the other route that I like to take. There's another flanking position. Uh, you never want to take the uh, the direct route down to their first point, or the middle point, uh, because it's just you'll get killed. They're always snipers, so there's this one window that you can climb across like that, jump in here. And uh, this is usually where I go. Uh, you always want to check for guys up here. I usually shovel them if possible. Uh, the Come on, we do. Come on. Shovels, indeed. Guys, mine is funny. And I got sniped there because that is a good sniping position for the American team. I don't know which team I like better. I would probably say the German team because they have better um, assault rifles. The USA assault rifle is actually very, very powerful, but um, the thing about that is that it lacks accuracy a lot. So it's really good for close range, but it's not so good for other places. Got that guy on the roof there, and I don't think I end up capturing this point. Um, yes. Now, if you always can, if you know you're going to die, pull out a grenade, pull the pin, and just uh, let go of it, because usually people run over to the, your body to check if you're dead. <laughs> But, um, going around here, uh, I'm going to take the left route this time, it looks like. 
and uh, kept retaking our uh, last point. We got that guy, but he got me. And uh, I actually, oh, I actually took the point. The and he killed me, which is unfortunate, and we lost this round. But um, we can't win them all. And that is another one of my favorite parts of this game: is that killing people after the round. It's so fun. I usually pull out my shovel and shovel people to death with my German shovel. It's just, it's so funny. Alles Leading klar, the server as you Packen see. Uh, I do fairly well in this game. I am a very good player at this game. The way to do well is just keep a standard, um, try to keep an even record if you can, and you just get as many captures as you can, your name will be on the top of the scoreboard. As you see, within just probably about, like, I would say I've been playing for about five minutes now, and uh, I'm already at the top of the scoreboard, so, uh, very useful strategy for that. Now, I've noticed some of the guys, uh, if you get too linear and you follow the same path as I just did, that guy has killed me, I think, like twice in a row now, and uh, he ends up killing me quite a few more times as well, so try to mix it up a little, as you see I'm doing here. I'm going to the right instead of the left. I would say if you want to take the last point, definitely go left and flank into that building on the, on the left. Um, but if you want kills, go on the right because it's easier to just get kills. As you see, take out your shovel here, because it's always so satisfying, so, so satisfying to get a uh, shovel kill with the German. So you have flanking around, uh, use the smoke against them. I get this guy one right here. I thought there was another guy, but I turned away. There it is again, that same guy gets me. And uh, he's very good, this guy. Uh, I've seen him all around. Was that the same guy? I don't know if that was, but the guy who's been killing me a lot, um, I've seen him on multiple servers, and uh, his ranking gets pretty high up there. Like uh, Right now, I'm about 5,000 points, which uh, you know, for every server, you start off on 1,000 points, and uh, you go up from there. So I've gotten up pretty far, and it, once you get a, a higher rank, it does get harder to rank up because if you die, if a lower player kills you, um, you lose the amount of points he gets, or half the amount of points he gets. So you want to aim for killing higher level players and not getting killed by lower level players. And uh, that should help you a lot if you want to get ranked up. Now I think I get in a pursuit here, yeah. Unfortunately I run out of uh, sprint here and uh, he ends up getting out, and I don't think I get a new life. No, I do not. Uh, so, we're ending the near here. Uh, we're getting near the end here. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed, and stay tuned if you like this. Uh, there'll be other games, such as Mountain Blade. Uh, it's kind of difficult to find a Counter-Strike server these days, but uh, I'll look for some. Uh, they're mostly just modded with the Parachute mod and everything like that. But uh, So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and see you guys next time.